Some people think that cultural traditions may be destroyed when they are used as money making attractions aimed at tourists. Others believe it is the only way to save these traditions. Discuss on both sides and give your opinion. For this line used as money making attractions aimed at tourists, you can use if they are modified to attract tourists and uh, you can also use revenue earning attractions you can use these words or sentences to explain this in your essay for culture traditions may be destroyed for this you can use cultural traditions disappear altogether for it is the only way to save these traditions you can use if we don't use them for tourism these cultural attractions will die and you can also use safe cultural traditions and this this essay is about tourism so you can make different collocations by using this word tour and different sentences look at these topic related vocabulary words and sentences so alluring for a uh, tourist cultural tourism lure tourists attract tourists traditions for tourists number of tourists and new concept of tourism and safe cultural traditions you can these are all topic related vocabulary words you can use them in your essay to show the examiner that you have a range of vocabulary and this is very important so look at the introduction it is irrefutable that cultural traditions lure tourists from all over the world and develop local economy some individuals are of the opinion that these may be destroyed if they are modified to attract tourists others however hold the view that if we don't use them for tourism these cultural attractions will die in the following paragraph i shall discuss both sides of the argument i personally side with the later view those who say that cultural traditions should be modified to make them alluring for tourists argue that cultural tourism is the backbone of any country's economy and every country should do its effort to attract tourists even if it means changing some traditions to lure tourists now example for example there is a temple in south india where people can enter only after wearing a dhoti <clears throat> my uncle uncle who is a sikh was asked to remove his turban and wear the dhoti he was not allowed to go in because he refused to take off his turban once this message goes out obviously the number of tourists would come down however if there is laxity in this tradition for tourists then their number would go up on the other hand the main reason why some people say that <clears throat> cultural traditions are damaged when used as revenue earning attractions is that when these traditions are altered then these lose their original features sometimes it makes cultural traditions disappear altogether for example in jas jaisalmer in india the local arts and crafts are not completely produced in a local village with local stone instead put potters use materials of an other territory to make goods glossy to attract tourists that is why some people say that it leads to the loss of local cultures i believe that culture and tradition are deep rooted and minor superficial changes cannot harm them in any way change is the law of nature and all we should look into it that changes are made with caution to retain the inherent elements of culture that is why a new concept of tourism creative tourism has come up which entails bringing in changes that would increase the number of tourists without damaging the basic culture and tradition of any place summing up to save cultural tradition there is a need to make some changes to make them captivate the tourist of today if this is not done then cultural traditions as well as tourists 
both will be lost. 